Today we're going to talk about iron overload, hemochromatosis. Essentially this is when your body stores too much iron, damaging organs, causing diseases and sexual dysfunction. Iron is an essential mineral. Your cells, tissues and organs need iron, but your body doesn't produce it. Iron is absorbed in the intestines from micronutrients from your food. Vitamin C and vitamin B6 are also needed from your diet in order for iron to be absorbed well. About 10% of the iron you eat is absorbed unless you have hemochromatosis and absorbed 30%. Your body utilizes iron for many different functions, from DNA synthesis and cell growth to muscle and brain functionality. About a third of iron is stored in the liver, spleen, and bone marrow, but when too much is stored, this can cause chronic diseases, inflammatory illnesses, autoimmune conditions, and cancer. Your liver is actually a strong organ which is programmed to regenerate itself, but over time, toxic iron buildup can cause cirrhosis, which is scarring of the liver, liver failure, liver cancer, or even an enlarged liver. Excess iron is also stored in your pancreas, causing diabetes, and in your heart, causing irregular heartbeats, enlarged heart, and problems to do with heart muscle and inflammation. As the level of iron increases in your bloodstream, your risks of heart attack and stroke increase too. So iron accumulation collects in these organs, the liver, pancreas, heart muscle, plus joints causing pain, but also arthritis, and accumulates in the pituitary gland and testicles. Too much iron in the body can actually lead to sexual dysfunction and fertility issues. Problems present over time as loss of sex drive, infertility, hypogonadotrophic hypogonadism, a lack of hormones that normally stimulate the ovaries or testes, amenorrhea, which is no periods in women, shrinkage of testicles in men, impotence called erectile dysfunction. Erectile dysfunction will actually happen to about 33% of men by the age of 50 and increase to 42% of men by the age of 60. As men age, they almost all suffer what is called erection dissatisfaction. And out of all men suffering from ED, 44% are experiencing this problem because of a health defect. So let's prevent this. All in all, if left unidentified or untreated, hemochromatosis can cause death in many different ways. And we should not be suffering from these disorders, dysfunctions, or the fatal diseases it causes. Fortunately, Randox Health are turning the tables. No more sick care which is making the drug companies and industries of medical treatments billions in revenue, but personalized Randox healthcare, making it accessible and affordable and actionable when early signs are still small and easily corrected. It is now so simple to review and monitor your body, control the future of your well-being. We can actually identify the earliest signs and prevent internal damage and long-term health problems with Randox Health, including hemochromatosis. Randox Health know that measuring iron alone is not sufficient because the deficiency and the overload cause similar symptoms to present in the body over time. Randox Health measure and calculate as standard five tests for iron from your blood sample. Iron, ferritin, transferrin, transferrin saturation, and total iron binding capacity. We can also test to confirm if your iron overload is genetic. The data we gain shows the absorption, binding, transport, and storage of iron in your body. Therefore, Randox can also identify anemia, the condition of too little iron, or irregular iron absorption or storage. For instance, low iron levels called anemia also result in liver disease, inflammation, and chronic kidney failure, similar to iron overload. But also noting that Randox actually have tests for chronic kidney disease and liver damage inflammatory markers called cytokines, so much more than any routine health check or prescription pill, which often negatively impact a different part of your body. Prescription medications, contraceptive pills, and all-in-one supplements can actually cause the imbalances and health problems in the first place. Randox actually had a woman with anemia during pregnancy who was continually prescribed and refilled with iron tablets from her practitioner, without correct monitoring, which caused her to develop hemochromatosis and store iron after having her baby. This made her extremely tired and weak with memory fog in just a few short months, which was the last thing she needed with a new baby to care for. One trip to Randox Health showed clearly all of her personal body data and the main culprit, culprit 
the iron prescription, which was then stopped. Her symptoms subsided and her data greatly improved, preventing diabetes, liver damage, and heart failure in the process. A young gentleman who came for his corporate, Randox Health Check, found out he was showing hemochromatosis from his blood measurements, a huge surprise to this fit and healthy, active young guy. He later shared with us that his father died at a young age from liver and heart disease, which he was thrilled to prevent. He also shared a second cause for celebration, a matter he hadn't realized had been diminished, that his private parts and his private life had dramatically improved after a few months of reducing his iron overload. There's also cases where the cause of death is stated as heart attack and heart failure, but it was actually specifically hemochromatosis and liver damage, putting strain on the organs and resulting in death. Randox Health measures your functional proteins, which are for structure and transport, signal, receptor, gene regulation, enzymes, and so on. And Randox do this for all major organs and systems in your body, in one go, with one hyper health check. And trust me, it's worth the hype. One of the many reasons Randox routinely measures many different minerals, proteins, enzymes, hormones, vitamins, which are what we call proteomics or biomarkers in your blood. It's because more measurements, the more data, the more intel, the more personalized and predictive and preventive, so the more we can help you optimize your health, prevent those persistent problems now, and then the less of the lifetime you spend in sickness. Individuals usually experience no symptoms outwardly during the early stages of hemochromatosis or most chronic conditions. But as with almost everything in your body, measuring inwardly is the best way to identify the early signs or imbalances and prevent these disorders, which would develop into disease and organ damage. So how do we get too much iron? A person might have a high affinity for iron, which binds tightly in the body and is retained or stored as ferritin, or lifestyle choices such as high iron diet, or increased alcohol consumption, which actually increases hemochromatosis. About a third of alcoholics were found that excess iron stores and that they decreased when they came off alcohol. Some individuals are just predisposed or programmed to store iron. And the disorder is actually in Celtic genes. About one in five Irish are known to have this disease, sometimes known as the Celtic curse. In such gene pools, it doubles the risk of arthritis and quadruples the risk of liver disease, causing higher risk of diabetes, chronic pain, and heart problems. Family values and now science can help us look after our loved ones, so we invite you and your family tree to prevent this and many other disorders from developing by coming to Randox Health and bring your health to life.